over the next 10 years, what are the most important things that India has to do and get right if it is to achieve these ambitions of greater space, greater presence, and greater influence on rulemaking? My answer would be, uh, at one level, really to keep finding the right combination of uh, partners to advance your interests. You know, your economic partners, your political partners, your security partners, your technology partners, your energy partners are not the same. So the weightage will differ, sometimes the combination would differ. But if you make a kind of a aggregate mm -hmm. of, of all of this, you will get a clear set of outlines. Yeah. Not every country would declare this openly, but there are very few countries which don't have a sense of who their fundamental partners are and who their fundamental challengers are. Mm -hmm. So the way to rise, I would say, is to maximize that uh, the opportunities. And the opportunities are provided by the contradictions of the world. You know, every rising power looks for contradictions because if there were no contradictions, there's no space for the rising power to move. So it's not like, what would you wish for? I take the world as I get it. Yes, today, perhaps a little more than I was before, I could shape some of it. But I'd be honest, I, I don't think I can fundamentally shape the world. I, I think there's still many other powers much more powerful than me uh, who have that capacity. But I would, look at their, uh, I would look at the global contradictions and assess from that the uh, possibility of utilizing that to my national advantage. Now, having said that, you know, there are times uh, when you would hedge, mm -hmm. or I would hedge. Yes. Uh, there are times when I, I don't think hedging by itself should be a reflex policy. Mm -hmm. It would depend on the situation. It would depend on the issue. Uh, it would depend on the on the moment, you know. Uh, so there are issues, I think, where we need to be much more, in a sense, simplistically in the middle. Uh, there will be issues where, you know, it would be foolish for me to be in the middle because my interests are clearly sort of uh, involved and uh, I need to actually set the narrative. And part of, you know, what you said to uh, to uh, try to become, aspire or seek to become a leading power is that ability of picking and choosing, you know, where to shape, where to, uh, where to actually get ahead, where to be a little bit prudent, where to be in the middle. So it's, it's really a very nimble footwork, yes. uh, if you would say. Mm. Uh, uh, and uh, it's, a, it's a very 360 kind of uh, vision of of the world uh, and its prospects. And I think that's really what is required for this country and for some time. I mean, I, I still think we have good ways to go. I mean.